Hey guys, James here. Gonna try something out here. Tried it once before, didn't go over too well with my fish, but uh, gonna try making my own fish food. So, the first time I did it, I made shrimp, scallops, and flounder. I mixed that with my seaweed and some uh, vitamins from Sea Camp. Froze that and I fed that to my fish. I gave them a couple tries of it across a couple different days and um, I could see them eating some but not all of it, uh, spitting some stuff out. But because shrimp, flounder, and scallops are all white meat, couldn't tell what they were eating and what they were spitting out. So this time I decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the shrimp and feed them the shrimp and see if they eat that or spit that out. So I got a quarter pound of shrimp here. Again, it's only really a trial right now. Um, the reason why I'm doing my own fish food is I'm reading that it's healthier for the fish. It's uh, cleaner for the tank. And right now I feed it with uh, flakes with the garlic, which uh, I'm reading now garlic is uh, uh, hurtful long term. Good to, for immune system, good for getting your fish to eat, but uh, long term it corrodes uh, the, immune, uh, the system of the fish and actually uh, shortens the lifespan. So, like I said, I got a quarter pound here. Went from my uh, local shop here. And just so there's a shell. Got to clean it all up. Also, a quarter pound only cost me two dollars and sixteen cents. I'm not sure how long this is going to last, but I'll take you guys through this. So here we go. First thing we're going to do, of course, dump them all out into a strainer and we'll clean and deshell them. I'll keep the bag for the deshelling. After I get all the shells off, guys, it's time to clean the shrimp, make sure you devein them, de poop them, all that fun stuff. You see right here, the stuff going right down there. I'm going to pull all that out. Sometimes you need a little knife to get in there. Alright, <clears throat> so I got one, two, three, four, five, six decent sized shrimp here, guys. What I'm going to do is Plop them right into the food processor. Alright, I'm gonna go with grind. Mix it up a little bit. As you guys can see, chopped up pretty well. So now what I'm gonna do, take ice cube tray I have. This is just for my fish stuff. This is a silicone bottom, so they allows you to pop each one out. About an inch diameter. So take the blade out. All right, and then like this one, I'm not gonna put any uh, vitamins in this because this is I'm looking to see what the, the fish will eat and what they don't eat. So this is all shrimp, nothing but shrimp. There's nothing else, no fillers or anything. So let's see how many cubes I get out of this or actually they're not cube because there's not square but you guys know what I'm talking about what I mean alright just about done try to get as much as I can alright so 
So let me wash my hands again. And then what I'll do, so what I got here, I got three by three, so what, nine little uh, cubes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, not bad. Nine off a quarter pound of uh, shrimp. And like I said, I'm just right now trying to see what, if any, my fish actually like eating. So then I can uh, make full trays. And what I'll do is just gotta make room and I'll just slide that in there and just let it freeze overnight probably give it two days or so in there and then we just gotta clean it all up alright guys stay tuned thank you like comment subscribe